Okay, so the next piece of data we have to collect is um, a stream profile. So your lab says to measure the stream across, and I measured it across, and it's 435 centimeters. So I have to divide that by 10, because I have to get 10 measures, so that's 43 and a half centimeters. So we'll round it to about 44. Every 44 centimeters we have to record data. So Aaron, you're gonna record data. Okay, Aaron, my depth at 44 centimeters so is two. Two? Yep. CM Divi divided by 10 just, the length. Just two. don't worry about that. Write down one is two. Where? Where? Does it matter if you're in two Yes, it does. Straight down that column. Okay. Oh, I think I got some water on my boot. Wow. Ah. Six. 88 and 14. Okay. This water is cold. Oh yeah, you're right. I was looking for a rock. 19. 19. What is it, 36? 156. I mean, we'll do that with ourselves. No, 220 and 44. 166. 220? 266. 266. <laughs> Math. 21. 310. That's there at 12. Okay. 14. What's that? 356. 21, 14. Yeah. Okay. Dust off my paper. 9. 9 for 8. 390 is next, right? Eight, and then the bank is zero, right? Nice little zero. To the left, which one? Oh, yours not. Good. You're good. Good, you can stop it. Look. Here's a summary of the stream profile data. You must graph this data on the following page in your lab. Please be sure you are graphing the stream profile and not a mountain. Many kids do that, and it doesn't turn out looking right, and it's wrong. You don't get credit. Look at the picture in the lab to help you.